Recovering America's Wildlife Act, or House Bill 3742, is a constitutional amendment to the Federal Aid and Wildlife Restoration Act, also known as the Pittman-Robertson Act, created in 1937. Within this bill, it would designate around $1.3 billion back to state wildlife agencies for the conservation of their threatened and endangered species. Texas alone would receive over $60 million for the conservation and management of some of our iconic species, such as the Texas horn lizard, the black bear, red cockaded woodpecker, Louisiana pine snake, and a host of many other species which are iconic to this state. However, this bill would not create any new taxes, but would merely be a reallocation of funds already designated to the Treasury of the United States. These taxes are coming from exploration for oil and gas on federal lands. Wildlife across Texas and the nation are in great need of a funding mechanism for their conservation and management, and this bill would provide that funding. The SFASU Student Chapter of the Wildlife Society began advocating for Wawa back in the fall of 2018. We started off by creating a letter to send out to representatives who have not yet signed on the bill. We then had members of the club sign the letters, and we ended up sending over 600 letters out to the representatives. We then were interviewed by local uh, newspapers such as the Daily Sentinel and the Pine Log. We then sent uh, members of the club uh, to speak to local organizations such as the Fredonia Rotary Club and the local chapter of Safari Club International to present presentations about RAWA. As far as this semester, uh, in this school year, we are sending uh, more letters out to representatives. We are also trying to contact more organizations uh, to present to about RAWA, and we are trying to meet with local representatives uh, to talk about uh, RAWA. The Texas Alliance for Fish and Wildlife has identified a necessary number of 175 co-sponsors for the passage of the bill. Just recently, the bill has reached 157 co-sponsors nationwide. Out of all the representatives in Texas, 28 have yet to sign the bill. We must secure co-sponsors in order to move the bill forward, and there is no better place to start than within our own state. After passing through the House, the bill will then be moved to the Senate after which it will be signed into law by the President. There is still a lot of work to be done. Restoring America's Wildlife Act is the greatest piece of wildlife legislation since the Pittman-Robertson Act of 1937. Now it's your turn to take action. Contact your Texas representative at the link in this video and express your concern. 